Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And let's check out that evening forecast. We'll see some scattered showers drifting across the area, especially later this evening after sunset and temperatures in the low to mid 40s. We'll actually pull those numbers down a little bit as some of the rain gets underway. Right now, mid to upper 40s over most of the region. And then uh, tomorrow morning, look for some cloudy skies at 8 o'clock, about 41 degrees. We'll still have a chance of some spotty light rain showers tomorrow, 46 at noon, and then more in the way of just plain old cloudy skies at 5 o'clock with temperatures late day up near 50 degrees. So tonight, a little bit of light rain in some spots tonight and into Tuesday. We'll see temperatures a little milder on Wednesday. Should jump in the upper 50s, maybe close to 60 degrees. But some heavy rain moves in on Thursday. Some windier conditions arrive on Friday. Much cooler late week, and we have, the, again, the potential for frost and freeze come Saturday morning. Of course, that'll be Halloween. And temperatures over the next 12 hours, you can see not a lot of movement here, just dropping off slowly through the 40s and heading down toward 40 degrees later. Late tonight around 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. And then tomorrow afternoon, we're expecting high temperatures up north, uh, anywhere from the mid 40s to the upper 40s, 47 in Troy, 49 in Springfield, and then down toward the Dayton area, Springboro, Xenia, Wilmington around 50 degrees with some upper 40s to the west out toward Richmond and also Eaton. And there's that milder air coming in on Wednesday. You can see those numbers getting into the upper 50s, even close to 60 degrees in some locations. Goodwill Auto Auction camera, you know, the winds out of the north at the low levels today and that's why you can see those clouds drifting toward you on the uh, Goodwill Auto Auction camera. Occasionally we've had some drizzle coming out of those clouds. Not a lot in the way of precipitation right now, but we do have a pretty solid area of some light rain coming across central Indiana from Indianapolis down toward Evansville and even a few uh, lead out showers there across southeastern Indiana and the southwestern portions of Ohio. Those could be drifting through here over the next hour or so. And then uh, cold enough to the west of us, even into central Missouri, Missouri, some snow, and of course you heard about that snow out in Colorado. It's even been snowing in the Texas, Oklahoma panhandle areas today uh, with the cold air that's in place out there. New Mexico picking up snow. Right now in Dayton, 48 degrees. We have wind out of the north, 5 miles per hour, dew point at 43 with a relative humidity 83%. And the temperatures tonight, low to mid 40s up north uh, to the upper 40s in the southern part of the Miami Valley. Warmest readings now, Springboro at 49, also Wilmington at 49 degrees. Here's your future track forecast. Some rain showers passing through. Uh, as we get toward midnight, becoming a little more spotty, just generally cloudy skies. A chance of a couple of sprinkles in the area during the day tomorrow. And then we could actually see some breaks in the clouds start to move back into the area on Wednesday. So we may see a little bit of sunshine mixed with those clouds on Wednesday and uh, also allowing for those temperatures to warm up a little bit more. Tonight, though, cloudy and chilly. Some light rain showers around. Overnight low temperature near 40. Cloudy cool tomorrow. There is the chance of a shower and a high temperature near 50 degrees with a northeast wind at 5 to 10. 43 at 10 o'clock, 46 degrees at noon. We'll be up near 50 at 4 and 49 degrees at 6 o'clock in the evening. On Wednesday, a high temperature of 58, a mostly cloudy sky, but a little sunshine mixed in with the clouds. And then rain is going to be likely on Thursday. As a matter of fact, that could be some heavy rain. 55 for the high temperature. Windy drying out on Friday, but cooler Morning lows in the 30s, high temperature near 50. And then on Halloween, a morning low of 30 degrees, frost freezing temperatures likely, but a nice afternoon up into the mid 50s. It looks like uh, 42 on Sunday morning with a high of 57. Don't forget to set the clocks back this weekend. And Monday, uh, again, cool in the morning there, chilly in the morning in the 30s with a high temperature in the 50s and mostly sunny.